Hello, hello. Is anyone on yet? Yeah, six people are on. Oh, now there's 13 people. Hello, hello, 30 people, hello. Hello, hola, hi, hello. How's everyone doing? Hi, hi buddy. How's it going? How's it going? Hello, hello. I don't know why I'm doing this. Why am I doing this? <laughs> impulse. It was an impulse, so congratulations. You guys get to be here. Oh, I ate dinner again because I need to do something else. I can't focus on this entirely. You can send me a greeting. Yes, I sure can. Hello. Graham, you always go live at the latest times. I mean, yeah, I guess. Sorry, I'm, it's, it's that or never, <laughs> so I'm sorry. <laughs> um, aw, Juliana, you guys, you, you're so handsome, thank you. 3 a.m. in Brazil, mate, oh shit, sorry. Don't mind, I'm not gonna be offended. <laughs> it's late for dinner, yeah, uh, yeah, but it's, it's this or no dinner, so... <laughs> Damn, it's 1 a.m. I have school tomorrow. Bro, I am not more important than school. You should go to bed. You should go to bed. I don't mind. I'm not going to be offended. How's everyone doing today? How's everyone doing? How's it going? What's new? What are you making for dinner? Spaghetti. As always. I love spaghetti. God, I love spaghetti. Is your brother here? No, I was just talking to him on Discord, though. He's in Boston right now. <laughs> nice teeth, bro. Thanks. <laughs> Appreciate it. Uh, when is Stargirl 2 coming? Your acting is fabulous in Stargirl. I appreciate it. Um, I don't know when Stargirl 2 is coming. You should ask uh, Grace about that. It's 8.40 a.m. here. Jesus, you like the next day, right? Like it's February for you. I'm not sure what a SAG voucher is. I've worked almost entirely in Canada. Can you do a kip up? <laughs> yeah, on a, I'm not, I don't want to. I think in theory I can. <laughs> nice ceiling, thank you. I made it myself, I didn't, it's a lie. You believed it, no you didn't. Stargirl is my comfort movie, oh, I'm glad to hear it. I'm, I'm really glad to hear that actually. Thank you. Uh, do you celebrate Lunar New Year? I'll celebrate whenever. Uh, so yeah. Don't, <laughs> don't tell me how to live my life. I'll go to bed when I... I, I have worked through LA and I've worked in the States, but like I live here. Most of the stuff I've done has been here. So, uh, most of the film industry I'm familiar with is Canadian. Nice hoodie, bro. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, anyone recognize this? You get extra points if you can tell me whose merch this is. Um, you did a great job at Two Cents Horror Stories. Thank you, Vlad. I appreciate it. Here, um, but he fucking, oh my God, dude, you crushed it. You are here? You're crazy. You're, you're cracked, bro. <laughs> um, no, it's so good. I love watching you guys. It was fun to film, man. Shit, I have to work at 7 a.m. and it's 1 a.m. here, but your life's worth it. No, it's not. Go to bed, man. I'm real. I'm sorry. Go to bed. <laughs> I'm not worth it. You still friends with Grace? Yeah. Um, how are you doing? I'm doing all right, you know? 
I guess better than usual, uh, better than average over the last couple of years, but you know, I'm all right. NFTs, no thank you. Um, do you rent movies? Yeah, if I don't have it, I gotta make food. And it's really mostly for fun. It's super fun. Uh, but apparently I've been doing a cartwheel on the wrong side because my instinct is to go this way on my right side first. Uh, but you want to do it in the direction that you're spinning. Uh, and this, if you follow it through, you're spinning. I would be spinning to the right. And when I spin, I spin to my left. So if I were to continue on that path and eventually do like a round off uh, into like a spinny flip thing, I would be spinning the wrong way. So I need to relearn cartwheels the other way so that eventually I can do a round off and spin flips. The better question <laughs> is why are you? We should do a live video discussing that. Um, uh, <laughs> what are you cooking, man? Uh, spaghetti. You want some? Come over. <laughs> Dance theory explained. I wish I could do that. I wish I could do that. Man, wouldn't life be fun if I knew how to dance? <laughs> By the way, you look so good today. Thanks, you too. Have you ever counted to 100? This is, this is what I'm here for. This is what I want to see. Uh, yes, I have. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> have you? Have you counted to 100? I have. Doing a f a f I'm writing a feature on existentialism at the moment, so I'm fired up on it easy peasy. Ooh, I want to hear. I want you to. I want you to lay this on me. I want you to. When when you get the chance, I want to hear about what you're writing about. Have you hunted or fished? I've never gone hunting, but I've done fishing. What game do you like the most? Probably Portal Two. I think Portal One is also just fantastic.
come back to Twitch eventually, but <laughs> it's not the most important thing in my life. This is why I'm telling you, please don't subscribe to it because it's not a very big priority. <laughs> I'm just not going to start making this video for another 10 minutes. All right. I know. <laughs> I know. Uh, do you like to ski or snowboard? I do. I've never been snowboarding, but I, I've been skiing a lot. Still subscribe, Mr. Grimm. Waste of money, man. Don't do it. Don't make me delete the channel so you get your... Wait, does that give you your money back? Do you have any pets? No. One day. I want to. I want a cat. Actually, wait, I shouldn't have said that. Because I want to know if you think I'm a cat or a dog person. I feel like people should assume that I'm a... the right answer. Uh, for me, anyway. But a good friend of mine, just the other day, apparently thought I was a dog person. Can you bite your tongue? <laughs> yeah? Why do you want- why do you want that? <laughs> Like, I don't even under- I don't understand. Um, what was this? I feel like you're a dog person. Uh, interesting. Interesting. Okay. Anyone else? I'm gonna say dog. Cat hoodie explains a lot. Remember the Dylan Graham livestream days? Man, I would get Dylan on here if you wanted to. Uh, well, if he was on. Uh, that would be awesome. I love that guy. want? Um, a small one with a good turn radius and good fuel economy and cheap. I don't, I take transit everywhere. I'm literally, I'm only getting my license because for work. Um, did I see Lily on there? I thought I did for a second. Hold up. Let me scroll up. You friends with Michelle Kleber? Yeah, I love Michelle. She's the best. Cooking for self is therapeutic, but it's also a pain. It is torture sometimes. Um, yeah, what's up, Lily? How's it going? How are you? How did that assignment go? <laughs> what was it like filming with Danica McKellar? Uh, wow, that was a long time ago. How do you, why do you, why, why are you thinking about that? So like, just curious, is that movie still going on? Um, she's wonderful. She, I remember, cause I, you know, I'm a fucking nerd. Uh, I remember being on set and we had a race to see. Uh, or that. Yes, sorry. Turkey Hollow was really nice. Thank you. <laughs> this is literally how much names can well call Graham with ham at the end in a year game. Um, it's a creative game. You still talk to Dylan? Yeah, man. Um, Dylan is the best. Bro, happy almost birthday, OMG. <laughs> you were letting me lie about you for cruise. You got full marks. Yeah! Yeah! I'm so proud of you. <laughs> I'm really glad I could be helpful. Um, thank you. 
almost uh, almost almost no longer. Hate when he points out my slippy mistakes. <laughs> Makes me <laughs> not like to edit him, but you know he's too fucking nice at times. <laughs> hey, okay. To be fair, you make fun of me so much. I'm allowed to make fun of you back a little bit, or else you're not allowed to make fun of me. <laughs> before my mom scalps me. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Good night. <laughs> Good to see ya. Belen XRS. I do now. I'll never forget you. I'm sorry, that's probably not true. Um... need this yet. Can you see you guys? Can you see you guys? This is what I see. Oh god. Can you you can be a good next gen Spider-Man? Hey that would be fun. I like Tom Holland though. Okay, okay. Still wondering why you were cooking this late? Because I can only do so much uh, during the day, and I run out of time. What do you think about Deep Rock and Risk of Rain? Um, I, was, I was wondering how you knew I'd played Risk of Rain. But I, remember. Um, I just started playing Risk of Rain today. Uh, phenomenal. I eat spaghetti at 11 p.m. <laughs> this is how I live. <laughs> and honestly, this is, like, probably my favorite part of how I live. <laughs> Talk to hi, Lana. Hi, Lana. Please don't spam the chat. <laughs> uh, do you have TikTok? No, never. Delete TikTok. Uh... Nothing against the community on that app. I love that. I just wish it was on a different app. <sighs> um, what would you name your cat? Great question. I'm open to suggestions. I don't know. I don't know. I, I feel like I think any cat... Um, TikTok is the worst. Yeah, it's bad. It's bad. The people on that app seem wonderful. It's just malware. Uh, and it's designed to hurt you. So, we're all better off if you stay off of it. Oh, yeah. I think you should call it GLaDOS or Wheatley. That's a, those are actually good names. That's a good, that's a good idea. Um, Pam. Yeah. It is late for spaghetti. I know. I know. Have you visited Machu Picchu? No, I haven't, but I would love to at some point. <laughs> Do you watch Blu-ray movies? <laughs> I guess not. I, it's not like I...
no question. All right. What's your plans for your birthday? Uh, not much. I've got a job coming up, which is exci exciting, but I've, I've just been really paranoid about COVID. Uh, and it's close enough to my birthday that I don't want to do anything, because if I get sick, then I get fired. So, don't want to do that. So, maybe I'll get, like, a couple people who are, you know, in my bubble, I guess, if we're I'm I'm happy about Hufflepuff now. I might go to Canada later this year if I do well in, your, in my testing. Um, awesome, like for school? Oh, Hufflepuff, yeah, fellow Hufflepuffs. Good, we'd love to see it. Love to see it. Oh God, this is, oh, oh God. I don't like dealing with raw meat. Like, since I moved out, I live on my own, I have almost become, like, effectively vegetarian just because I <laughs> avoided dealing with raw meat that much. <laughs> it's uncomfortable. I don't like it. So you like John Cena or what? Yeah! John Cena! <laughs> what song is stuck in your head right now? That's what I want to know. What song is stuck in your head? Or what's the last song that was stuck in your head? things to do always. Use dishes. All your angles are perfect. That is not true. That's untrue. <laughs> you don't see the ones. <laughs> you don't see all of my angles. <laughs> my mom has a daughter she likes. Aw. That's nice. We don't talk about Bruno. It's been stuck in my head for the last week. Oh, shh. Okay, numb little B. I've heard of, I've heard of We Don't Talk About Bruno. I don't remember why. Hard Way by Ernest. What else can I do for Encanto? I still haven't seen uh, Encanto. I thought you'd be talker. Like, you thought I'd be talking more? Sorry. I don't know what to tell you. I'm not a talker. <laughs> well... Publicly, I guess. Ooh, a lot of Encanto fans. Should I watch it? It's not like I've been avoiding it. I just haven't seen it yet. Love gun kiss. Oh, this is going to be stressful now.
Like, there are songs that I want to listen to day by day, but my all-time favorite song hasn't changed. Don't you need to charge your phone? Yes. Good memory. I'm probably going to get the 10 minute, the 10% warning in, like, a couple minutes. Do you have Twitter? Yes, I don't use it, though. I'm not active. But it's the same username as this one. Can you read questions? Yeah. Was that a genuine question, or was that petty? <laughs> Fuck. Eh, this is stressful. You know, I find it weird that I've been a Graham fan account for over a year and watched his eyes for around three years. Trap. Um, spent some time and I learned the piano solo at the beginning though. Fun. Can't do it too beautiful. Sauce. Have you seen Glee? Not in like 10 years. <laughs> Ooh, I'm almost out of tomato paste. Is your favorite song Stay the Night by Chicago? Are you guys stalking me on Spotify now? It's a, I don't mind. Spotify is one of the things I don't mind if you stalk me on. I don't mind if you stalk me on anything. I, like, I'm not going to judge you. Um, no. That song... Uh, uh, I listened to that song because the drummer is Jeff Prochero, who I really like. by Yusuf? Uh, no. Also a great song. Uh, I really like that song. I gotta stir this. I will stalk you everywhere. How many of you guys will admit to stalking me? <laughs> Is your favorite song by Grace Van Der Waal? Unfortunately not. It was close though. I saw Chicago on your Spotify. No, sh you're you're spot on. I mean, well, my the song I'm thinking of is not my is not by Chicago, but Chicago is top three favorite bands. Easy, easy. God, probably number two, I think. Super Tramp, Chicago, Little River Band, The Kinks. Kinks can be hit or miss. Definitely some hits. There's your hint. What's your favorite color? Uh, blue, a very special blue. Kennedy, how's it going? How are you? That was the 10% warning. <laughs> Hold up, give me a Control center broke for a second. Kennedy, how are you? How have you been? Ah, shit, I spilled beef. No, you got go. Oh, I'm so sorry. Are you doing all right? I will charge my phone, but it'll last for the rest of the time it takes to make this, so I'll be fine. Actually, I'm actually on low power mode now. now. Oh god. Ugh! This is so stressful! Do you want to be on any podcast? Um... I don't care either way. I would... 
Um, what's your favorite song by the Aubreys? Uh, I don't know. Anything by Malcolm Craig. Nothing against Finn Wolfhard. I just love Malcolm Craig possibly more than any other human in the world. Oh my god. Oh, we live in hell. Can you believe that Weeds Begonias are a year old already? Oh. Um, Jesus, it's been a hell of a year. <laughs> I got this big breath of smoke. I like Degrassi, I've never seen it. I never really watched TV as a kid. Kind of just played Club Penguin. How are you? I'm doing all right. You're still in Kelowna, right? When are you coming back here? Do you like Harry Styles? If your answer is yes, then marry me. Uh, Jesus, that's a lot of commitment. Um, I don't have anything against him. He seems very nice. Thoughts on our current situation. Would you mind elaborating on that? I'd be happy to tell you, but I don't know what situation you're talking about. Are you talking about like spaghetti? Or like a pandemic? Like there's a lot of things that a situation could be. Give me another game recommendation while I'm stuck on Baba Is You. Um, another puzzle game? Um, all right, how about I recommend a game I've never played, uh, but I've been meaning to. Uh, a Short Hike is almost 100%, I think, uh, positive reviews. Um, I've heard a lot of good things about it, and I've been meaning to play it. So why don't you play it and tell me how it is? Uh, it's not a puzzle game. It's more of an experiential thing, I think. Yeah, let me know when you let me know when you're back in when you're back in town, Um We yeah, we have to catch up. It's been a while. Because we've ch we've caught up a few times, but I don't think I've seen you since like in years, right? Have we? Not since school. Jesus. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. Ooh, I know what I want to ask you guys. I want recommendations on 20 minute long episode shows. 20 minute episode shows. That's what I want. It frustrates me that every show nowadays or everyone that's like recommended or popular um, has like 40 minute or hour long episodes. And it's frustrating because I want to watch it like while I eat or like before I go to bed and I don't want to be up for like an, another hour, you know? I want 20 minute shows. I'm watching Bob's Burgers right now. It's phenomenal. Uh, I'm rewatching Futurama. Uh, but I need more 20 minute shows. Hello, welcome. It looks like a bunch of people just joined. How's it going? Brooklyn Nine-Nine? Ooh. <laughs> Toxic from Two Sentence Horror Stories? 
I've heard great things about it. How doesn't everyone here watch it and get back to me? A superstore. Oh, is it good? I saw that recommended on, well, because it was on Netflix, I think, right? Uh, Brooklyn Nine-Nine. I should watch that again. Oh, I forgot about the water. Whoopsie. I was so focused on the sauce that I've literally forgot to make the spaghetti. Sometimes I'm smart, and then sometimes I'm not. Watch Peacemaker. Is that the John Cena one? I Met Your Mother, super fun. Oh, oh no, I'm thinking of It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia. Um, I've been really wanting to watch It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia, but I can't watch it in Canada. Yeah, Frustrating. Watch Ruby and the Well. What is that on? I'm not going to watch Big Bang Theory. Or Friends. Just before anyone recommends that. Uh, what's Ruby and the Well? I have watched Arcane. It was really good. 40 minutes, though. Super Random Beaver Great and Supergirl. Thank you. That was a super fun show. <laughs> a really big regret of mine... Because my dad on that show, Sam, uh, he was fantastic. Uh, super, super fun to work with. Uh, and I'm a massive Star Wars nerd. Uh, but I hadn't seen the Clone Wars yet when we filmed that. And I remember him like giving me like some like voice acting advice. And I was just like, oh yeah, that's awesome. That's super helpful. Thanks. And then, like three years later, I watched the Clone Wars finally. Because I'd been putting it off for years. And I saw the credits, and I didn't recognize his voice. I saw the credits, and I was like, holy shit, that's my dad. <laughs> um, and I got, like, retroactively starstruck. He's incredible, and I regret so badly not appreciating it at the time. Because um, he is so good. He's so good. Um, and he's, like, it's good to see someone in Star Wars who's, like, also a massive Star Wars nerd, and, you know, using that to its full potential, like, like he puts that much care into it, and you can see it. I haven't heard of Greenhouse Academy. Oh, I haven't seen Book of Book Fit yet. I've been wanting to. Avatar? Oh, yeah, I could rewatch Avatar. Oh, I've been. No, I wanted to watch that with a friend, so I hadn't yet. Um, that is a good call, though. I should watch Avatar again. Let's just say one could give me ailments thoughts. <laughs> I mean, whatever works. I've never been big on alcohol, though. Uh, did you play the Dark Pictures anthology? Uh, I don't know what that is. Legend of Korra? Yeah, I had to get a VPN to watch it, but it's so good. It's so good. It makes me sad that they, they weren't sort of, they weren't able to make an overarching plot throughout all the seasons. It's frustrating. I also really thought, because I'd heard so much about it and about the, like, the LGBT representation, and I was really excited for that, and I didn't realize that it was entirely implied. Uh... Which, you know, like, it's fantastic what they managed to do with what they were allowed to do. Um, but it's just sad. That was only, like, 2014. Right? Jesus. Uh, I haven't seen the new screen. Um, is it, should I? 
<laughs> hey, Mick, how's it going? How's the hot chocolate fest? I am... Um, I got your text. I can't. I can't. <laughs> I've been, like... Or at least I'm, I'm starting to, like... I've got a job coming up, so I'm isolating a little bit. Because I really don't want to get sick. Um, so I can't do anything fun like that. Even though I really want to. Is it still going? I want to know what the highlights are. What What's the best hot chocolate so far? I'd rather be taller or shorter. I guess taller, but I don't really care. Height isn't something I'm concerned about. What does this need? What does it need? Actually, that's a good point, anime. I haven't, I've only done a little bit of, I've only watched a little bit of, like, anime in general. I love FMA, it's, I watched it when I was really young, so it's, like, nostalgic now. Um, but I haven't really watched a lot more anime than that. I was watching Attack on Titan, but I can only get the first season on Netflix, and it's, I'm not great at finding consistent pirating sites, so it's, Team McGill, thanks for stopping by. Um, oh no, that's too much of that. Whoops. How can I get rid of that? Hello, Glenn. I already said hi to you. Like at the beginning. I said I would never forget you, unless that was someone else. <laughs> I forgot. Eternals. Oh, that's true. It's so easy to pirate. I know, I just really, I really hate ads. <laughs> oh. The other problem is that I was watching the, the, uh, the dub as well. And it's a lot harder to get to find. I don't know, I couldn't find a pirate at the dub. I have, I'm not great at finding them. I'll work on it. Do you rewatch all episodes of Futurama? No, not yet. I'm watching Bob Bur Bob's Burgers at the same time, so I'm only on like season three of both of them. <laughs> In the last week. <laughs> Should you become an actress? You always wanted to. Um, if that's something you really want to do, then there's no harm in trying it out. Yeah, it's really hard to make a career out of it. I've been l lucky. I say lucky. Because uh, it has nothing to do with how hard you work or anything like that. I've been lucky uh, to be able to, you know, pay the bills with it. But uh, if it's something you really want to do, you should try it out. See if, uh, see if it... Sparks your passion. Hey, I remember you from season three of Fire. You were adorable in that. Thank you. Oh, for sure. That was a, a fun accent. It's a difficult industry. So if you don't feel really passionate about it, then you shouldn't do it. Uh, but if you do, it's worth trying. Ooh, let's see, people have been using the question button. Hmm. Ooh, if you finish the series, then a new season comes a year later. Do you watch all seasons again or not? 
Great question. I haven't figured that out yet. I think I, I said I, I really haven't watched TV a lot throughout my life. So I'm sort of figuring these things out now. So far, yes, I have been. When I, whenever I... Because a lot of the shows I've watched came out a long time ago, so they're all done. Or, like, they're recent enough that there aren't new seasons. Um, I think I do. I do. All of the questions in the question buttons are comments I've already seen. Will you climb Mount Everest? No. I don't want to. Watch Stranger Things. I have. Um, Mount Everest is, like... It's an interesting geographical feature. I don't see a point in climbing it, though. back to the two people that just said they're back. What was it like working with Judah Lewis? An honor and a pleasure. Uh, oh, we haven't talked in ages. I love that guy. Oh, she called me Mr. Live. Her resolution is over. What's your phone percentage right now? I can't check. Uh, otherwise, it'll be really annoying on this. Sorry. Probably like eight. When's the last time you talked to Dylan? A couple days ago. I've been kind of out of it the last couple days. Um, do you have school? Nope. <laughs> Someone just asked, Es hetero? <laughs> Does that mean... <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? Um, how do you pronounce your last name? Vercher. How's everyone doing? Welcome to everyone who's new. Cameron, Andre's official. I'm making spaghetti. <laughs> your favorite. <laughs> What are you even doing? Do you consider yourself a good cooker? No, one day. <laughs> you love my spaghetti and you hate how much you love it. Oh yeah, the secret ingredient, I think. Can, can you see it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, it's right behind. <gasps> right? Right there. There it is, the secret ingredient. You love it. Admit it. Let's do not prawn again. It's been a long time. Italians would kill you. <laughs> I think I could make a case. I think I could. I think I could make my case. <laughs> Maybe I wouldn't tell them. I don't think. No, the Italians would kill me. You're right. <laughs>
All right, I'm gonna check my battery percentage. It's gonna pause. Don't panic. High enough. It's not high enough. It's nine percent. <laughs> All right, we've got some Simon Cowell hate in the comments. Cool. Why? Tell, make your case to me. Tell me. What, what makes you feel so strongly about Simon Cowell? <laughs> Do another dinner party soon. You may or not. I understand. I understand. I get it. I, I'd be happy to be there. Um, but you... It would be an honor. But I understand. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't bring my phone over here because it has to charge. Oh, fuck it, whatever. I'm really treating you guys today to be a one from the <laughs> Let's make the 12 year olds mad. What's your opinion on TikTok? I've answered this four times already today. Um, bad. And it's nothing against the 12 year olds on TikTok. I'm glad they have a place to go. I'm upset that that place is as harmful as TikTok. TikTok is bad. There are better places to go. And I'm not just saying that because like I'm a grouchy boomer, because I'm not. I love, I, like, I love the the people on there, and I, I love the concept of it. It's just malware. It's 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 a it's a terrible precedent to set. Like, if we show that we're okay with that, everyone else is going to do it uh, even more than they already are. TikTok bad. It's it's designed to be bad for you. They are selling your data. Uh, they're I don't even know if they're fucking selling it. They are stealing it, uh, gathering as much as they can. More than you know how people talk shit about Facebook. I talk shit about Facebook. That's what I do, that's why I don't do these very often because I don't like having Instagram. Uh, it's terrible. If I didn't need it for my job, I would get rid of it in a heartbeat. Um, TikTok is like that, but a hundred times worse. Um, it's bad. And if they get away with it, Facebook will do that too. That in addition that it's just designed to, like, Take your time at your expense. It's it, it, it wants your time so that you watch their ads at the expense of your brain. They don't care about you. They care about who will pay for your attention. Social media is created to give te glue teenagers to their phone screen and create a world where we never actually interact with each other in real life. I think that's a side effect. I don't think they necessarily don't want us to interact in real life. They just want as much of it as they can to be online. They want our data and our time. This is almost ready. It's going to go up a little bit. This is going to go down a little bit. So we'll just give that one more minute. I'm so excited. Are you mad? What happened? Nothing happened. I'm not mad. What do you do if you feel bored? I <laughs> suffer. <laughs> Uh, no, I, I'll, I'll just kill time, I'll watch a show or something, or I'll, if I'm feeling productive, then I'll clean or make music. 
I'm surprised Instagram hasn't kicked you off yet. Well, it's been almost an hour. Perfect timing. Because uh, I'm going to go in like a minute as soon as this noodles are done. Uh, which should be right about now. Because you don't want them to be... You don't want to take them out when they're done. You want to take them out like a 30 seconds, a minute before. Because they keep cooking. They're hot. It cooks when they're hot. And they're still hot. So it keeps cooking. You don't want overcooked noodles. You don't want soggy noodles. So you take them out a little before they're done. Oh yeah, see Cameron understands. Cameron understands, and he's a chef, <laughs> and an astronaut, <laughs> and a doctor. <laughs> Privacy is the illusion, at least for me here. Oh, it's, it's scrolled away, sorry. Privacy is the illusion, at least for me here. Uh, it doesn't tell if I have all my rights like a real human being. Uh, yeah. It's not easy, see that's, uh, that's what we want to avoid. Sorry, <laughs> Okay, this is okay, that's okay. I've made too much spaghetti, once again. It's all right. Save the light in your feet, sorry, I don't think so. I, I never do. I just don't like it. I don't like the idea of someone being able to go back and look at every little thing that I do. Uh, why would anyone like that? Um, dem democracy is a lie, sort of. Mm, democracy isn't a lie. I think sometimes we're led to believe democ the democracies we have are more honest than they are. Can't complain about too much spaghetti. You can't, you can't. It's like, oh, it's the opposite of a problem. Spaghetti tomorrow, spaghetti the day after, spaghetti for a hundred years. Never enough spaghetti. And here we go. Oh my God, that's so much spaghetti. <laughs> Uh, if you don't like people seeing every little thing, then don't search up Graham Brashear live stream on YouTube. Yeah, I don't, like, I understand that people are going to do it. But the people who are going to look that up on YouTube and watch the video are going to do that anyway. So I don't, there's nothing I'm going to do about that. Because they'll do it anyway. It's like the people who I'm, like, acquaintances with, who then see that at the top of their Instagram page. And it's like, why the fuck did he save this? I don't want to watch this. It's like, yeah, I don't want you to watch it either, you know? <laughs> Sorry <laughs> for bothering you <laughs> by being on Instagram, so. Um, it would be nice if we had first passed the post. I mean, if we didn't have first passed the post. <laughs> We didn't. <laughs> it would be nice if we didn't have first past the post. Uh, it would be nice if we had proportional representation. Oh, remember when we were going to have voter reform and that's why everyone voted for Justin Trudeau and then he didn't do it? Ooh, yeah. <laughs> that is what happened, right? I Do you think shapeshifters exist? No. I wish. All right, it's spaghetti time. And that's my favorite time. I'm supposed to be supposed to No, don't clip that. <laughs> okay, you know what? No, I think... Ooh, that's a lot of cheese. Um... Uh, <laughs> I think I said it would be nice if we had first past the post, which is untrue. So I think that's unquotable. <laughs> I think that's hard to take out of context because it's <laughs> not true. <laughs> uh, 
Um, I support proportional representation. Read me. What's your sign? Like zodiac sign? Like I hate horoscopes with a fiery passion. I think it draws people's attention away from the cool part about stars, which is not necessarily where they are when you're born. <laughs> it's where they are in the universe, and how big they are, and how far away they are, and what they're made of, and their history, and how they exist, and why they exist, and where they go, and where we go, and what happens uh, when they're all gone, and... oh. Yeah, <laughs> that's the shit. Which is science, not pseudoscience. <laughs> pseudoscience is a fun word that means bullshit. <laughs> it's a fun word that means misinformation. <laughs> uh, binary stars are the coolest things ever. Um, yeah, they're up there. They're up there. I don't know if they're the coolest things ever. Um, but they're close enough that I understand the point that you're making. Astrology, geez, <laughs> the astronomy. Thank you, Vlad. I couldn't have put it better myself. All right, I'm going to go eat my spaghetti now. Uh, thanks for stopping by, everyone. Uh, I'm going to go get off Instagram for the next month, hopefully. <laughs> oh, maybe I'll delete the app all the way. Although, the only, I haven't because I have my old account. Oh, web. Only like five and a half, four and a half months, right? <laughs> but I'm everything has gone perfectly so far. Oh my god, I like, cool. Oh. It's it was hard because it wasn't like a it wasn't like a like even like curiosity where there was like a or perseverance where there was like a five minute window where you get all your nerves out and then it's okay. It's like holy shit, that was a month of. Our, are we going to go forward in time 100 years or back in time 20? <laughs> um, yeah. Anyway, very exciting. I'm going to get off Instagram. Maybe I'll delete it. Yeah, I'm going to get off Instagram. Sorry. Let us see the spaghetti. Okay, sure. It's, it'll be the last thing you see. Enjoy.